we're the sea lion keepers here at the Cleveland Metro Park Zoo. And we're gonna show you guys a little bit what goes on behind the scenes here, so come on. We train our seals and sea lions three times a day for probably about 20 minutes each session. The only difference between training different animals is the animal themselves, their limitations of what they're physically able to do. This is Mikey. He's our older California sea lion. There he is now. Harbor Seals, Bonnie, Sydney, and Nemo. Nemo's our male, and Sydney and Bonnie are our two females. Um, with our Harbor Seals, they look a lot different than sea lions. They move around on the ground with their abdominal muscles, as opposed to their flippers like sea lions do. If you look at Mikey, he's got these external ear flaps, whereas the seals don't. And Bonnie is in our demonstration this year. She shows how harbor seals move on land. What Maurice is doing right there is working with Bonnie on how to target. Basically, they learn to touch it with the nose or a body part, and it's one of the first things we teach them. And you hear her using the word OK, and he's actually holding on the target. And the word OK is actually a bridge. Bridging the time she says that word to when he actually gets the reward, he knows he's done the correct thing and he's going to get a reward for it. It's the only reward that we can use with them is fish because it's the only thing they eat. We do have a limit in how much we can feed them a day and how much we can train them a day. And this year's uh, demonstration involves sports and the Olympics. Good. You do is you kind of take behaviors that they already know and just work them into a different theme. This is where we do a lot of our walker training in that a lot of it has to do with uh, medical procedures or just helping take care of them better. So we can weigh them twice a week, sometimes once a week. Okay. They stop to open in his mouth and so we can brush his teeth. We get a good chance to look at all of his teeth and holes. And I should give them some eye drops. Good. I give them that these are just artificial tears. Um, and this way when they get an eye infection or something, they'll already know how to take eye drops. This is just a really good way for us to get a body check. So I know this kind of looks like a crazy apparatus. Because it lets um, us as well as veterinarians work with hockey. But we've taught Hawk to stick his flippers out so we can see them manipulate them. What we do to practice a blood draw is we have a fake syringe. This just has a um, doll screw at the tip. Good. Good we do have stickers that say I saw Huck um, and that's to promote our sea lion demonstration just for to promote the zoo in general and um, we thought that would be a great idea so kids could come home and talk about the animals they saw and to celebrate the zoo's 125 years kids can answer a question and if they get it right they get a training card